So then we got the part of the machine story you've never heard. Listen, if you're a channel regular, if you rock with your boy, you already know we rock with the homie, Burt Kreischer. And the story of the machine is one of my favorite stories ever told on a comedy stage. But are y'all ready for this one? Let's run it, baby. Let's get it. Let's go. Have you been, so for those that don't know, yeah. it's only got like 70 million views, I think, or something like that. Only, so right? People, only. It's been picked up as a movie, I believe. Right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, we, we're doing it as a movie right now. And uh, it was really crazy because we were talking to the writer and the producer. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, yo, what? They're making a movie out of the machine story? Bro, what is that dropping? Or did it drop already? Let me know in the comments below if you know something that I don't. ASAP, bro. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta look into that. You feel me? I gotta find out. And uh, it was really crazy because we were talking to the writer and the producer, and they were trying to like pitch me story ideas, but they were tied to like real life things that had happened. One of the things that had happened, they were talking about strip clubs. And I Hold was, on, can we run through this real quick? You went on a trip to Russia. Oh, I, uh, in 1995, I, I, with my class, got involved with the Russian mafia, uh, <laughs> and then robbed a train with them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It sounds, it's so funny I say it, it, I have no connection to it. Like, I say it like, it, when the story went viral, the story went viral like four years ago, changed my career. This is why it went viral. This is the most interesting st part of this whole story that you're about to hear. When I posted it, one of the one of the girls in my class had just got online on Facebook, saw it, and was like, "Oh, I'm gonna comment real quick," and wrote in the comment sections, uh, "This story is 100 percent true." Legitimate. Oh uh, snap! I was in Bert's rushing class. He robbed us, <laughs> <laughs> and then tagged everyone in my class. That's you can't epic, pay for marketing. Like that. <laughs> you That's can't epic. get marketing like that. So, uh, so then it goes viral. It's got like I, I don't. I, 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 I can tell you how many views I got on my pages, but what happens was is content providers like the, oh, yeah. the fat Jewish or whatever, mm -hmm. they take it and put it, and they get 180 million views. Those are that's the game changer. Those guys, right, right, right. So they put they get, it gets bought as a movie. We're sitting in a pitch talking about story ideas for the movie, and they're like, oh yeah, maybe the machine can go to a strip club. And I was like, that's so funny. This is a true story. I went to a strip club when we were with the mafia. And, uh, the Russian mafia. Yeah, and they were like, uh, we walk in and they go, do you want uh, full touch or no touch? I'm like, who gets no touch? <laughs> <laughs> I'll go full touch, guys. I'll go full touch. And then we get in the room. She goes, take your pants off. And I was like, huh? What? Oh, no, 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 no. I want no touch. I want no touch. I want no touch. So wait, this is 1995. And I, I was, I lived in Tallahassee. Grew up in Florida my whole life. So the girl goes to give me a lap dance, and she smells horrific. <laughs> I mean, horrific. Uh, and yeah. I'm like, I'm like, I can stomach through this one. I'm getting a new chick for the next one. Yeah, of course. Get a new lap dance. Next chick smells identical. I mean, I mean, so bad, <laughs> what the so hell? bad that I'm like, ugh, what is wrong with these women? <laughs> Cut to uh, like 20 years later, I'm on a second date with my wife. And we walk into an Indian restaurant, and I go, "This smells like Russian horse." Oh my God. <laughs> he just had Indian food, and I had never had Indian food. It was curry. It was curry. Oh, it was curry. Man, I can see it all like curry that oh. night. And then, but curry is so bad in a lap dance. Yeah. You're just not having a cool. You're just like, oh, this is not Russian crazy. <laughs> not even a thought that it was curry food. So is that going to make the movie? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But well, like, I hope so. <laughs> it was so funny. Like it was, it was crazy because they were telling me story ideas, and I, and I had I lived it. But you tell it so much, you don't even. It doesn't even register as real. Right. It's you like just when people, character. Yeah, it's like when people talk to you about uh, professional football. Yeah. It's a part of your life that you're like, oh yeah, 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 yeah. You take so many pictures and go, oh thank you, thank you. That when they talk about it, you're like, oh yeah. Like another thing, we robbed myself because my bag's with my class. So we robbed me. <laughs> And we stole, my dad had given me a very sentimental pocket uh, knife. Uh, uh, and he was like, buddy, you'll need this when you're traveling through Europe and cutting a baguette and opening a <laughs> bottle of wine. And the mob stole it. <laughs> Just stole a pocket knife. And I was like, uh, maybe we shouldn't steal that. Right? <laughs> I mean, some of these kids have sentimental rings with, uh, with the guy, right? <laughs> so, By yeah. the way, the way you described that was, we stole from me. Yeah, we, yeah. dude, I, it, it was crazy how we stole, how we robbed people because... What we do is, 
They'd open the door up a little bit and then the How little, long was this? What do you mean? Like the rob it was a couple hours, right? Oh yeah, yeah, it was all night. It was all night. Uh it was all <laughs> night. It was my class was really quick, so we were just one train car, but there were like nine train cars. So we robbed everyone. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. That's crazy, bro. Yo, Bert Kreischer is that dude, man. A lot of people were telling me in the comments that the story didn't happen, that it wasn't legit. You know what I'm saying? So there seems there seems to be some sort of like confusion. But look, we're getting a movie out of it. You know what I'm saying? Um, Bert's classmates confirmed it. So you know it definitely happened. Listen, I'm gonna end this video right here. If you made it to the very end, you're the real MVP, baby. No cap. If you enjoyed this video, y'all know what to do. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching, gang. I appreciate y'all. Love y'all. Peace.